Welcome to the technical studies. In this video, I will show you how to lay out a concentric cone faster than the traditional method. Please subscribe and comment. In this example, the large diameter of the cone is 600 mm, small diameter is 400 mm, and the height is 350 mm. Draw the front view, as shown. Extend the lines CA and DB into seating at point Z. Note down the length DZ. Calculate the CD circumference. Diameter multiplied by 3.14, or pi, is the formula to calculate the circumference of a circle. 600 multiplied by 3.14 is 1884. So top side circumference is 1884. Note down this. Draw arcs, as shown. The radius shall be ZB and ZD. The width of the arcs shall be nearly half of the arc length. We know the arc length, or the circumference of the cone is 1884 millimeters and the radius of the cone is 1092 mm, let us calculate the including angle of the cone layout. To calculate the including angle, divide the overall circumference of the cone by 360 and multiply by the arc length. Calculate the circumference. Divide 360 by the circumference and multiply by the arc length. Now you have the including angle. Our goal is to find the half chord length, OP. Let us apply the trigonometric sine rule to find the OP dimension. The sine rule states that sine theta is equal to opposite side divided by hypotenuse. Here, sine theta equals 98.9 degree divided by 2 is equal to 49.45 degree. Hypotence is 1092 millimeters. If we reverse the equation, opposite side is equal to sine theta multiplied by the hypotenuse. Let us calculate. That is nearly 830 millimeters. If you need this calculator, please check in the description for the link. Mark 830 mm on both sides of the center line, as shown. Draw lines. Connecting the marks, intersecting the arc. Draw lines, connecting marks, MK and GK. The cone layout is completed. Erase the unwanted lines, punch mark the center line and the main lines. Thank you for watching, please subscribe, like and comment. Please suggest a topic for a new video tutorial.